It's a great little tool to have in your car, uh, especially because it's got this glass uh, punch on it. So if you needed to break a window, you just smack it like that. Hey guys, Brad here with Skyline Construction. And today we're gonna be taking a look at sort of an everyday carry tool. Uh, I keep this in my backpack. And what it is essentially is a, a knife sharpener, a glass breaker, a fire starter. Um, and it's about the size of a pen. So why don't you come on in here and we'll take a closer look at it. So this tool is primarily made out of aluminum. It measures six inches long and just a hair over six and a quarter. And it's about a half an inch wide. It's a great little tool to have in your car, uh, especially because it's got this glass uh, punch on it. So if you needed to break a window, you just smack it like that, just in case like if you have an emergency or something. Uh, very easy to get into a car window this way. It has the sharpener right here for a straight blade and then it screws apart like this and then you have a diamond uh, sharpener right here for your serrated blades. It also has small little groove right in here for say fish hooks if you really want. Now if you screw this off you've got your fire starter underneath. So it's a pretty handy little tool. Um, I'll just show you how it all connects now. You can put it together like this so you can sharpen your knife. I'll just give you an example here. This is the Leatherman Skeletool. If you want to see a review on this guy, I have one up as well. But yeah, essentially you just sharpen the blade like this and you can hit all these little parts in here. Now I'm going to hold it a little differently when I'm sharpening it, but but that's how you would sharpen it. You can get a really nice, um, a really nice edge on that. And then if you want to sharpen the blade, you hold it like this, and you just push it through. Okay. Now this isn't a tool that you would use, you know, to sharpen your really good blades. And I wouldn't recommend using this to sharpen your blades all the time. If you're going to do that, you might want to pick up a, a better sharpener. But if you're out in the bush or, you know, if you're cutting your cutting a lot of stuff and you really need a sharper edge, um, this does work. It actually works quite well. Um, now for the fire starter portion, um, you can use it in a couple different ways. Number one, you can strike it against here, which I don't really like to do. And now I, I haven't really used this. I've just tried it. Um, I haven't actually used this in, in the field. But, you know, if you start striking it against your blade sharpener, you're going to dull this. So what I would recommend is screwing it on to the pen itself and then using your knife, but use the back edge, the dull edge. So when you're striking um, to, to start a fire, make sure your blade, number one, is locked. You don't want that folding on your finger. But then you can just start your fire like that. So it's, it's a decent uh, starter, mostly, you know, for emergencies. I wouldn't use this all the time because uh, I don't think you can buy replacements for this. So you'd really just have to buy a replacement uh, pen essentially and they run anywhere from you know 25 to 40 bucks depending on what you you find on amazon uh, i'll leave a link down below um but yeah it's, it's it's a pretty cool tool it's nice and light um you know it's it's just something nice to have in your pouch it's nice and small it's compact and just a little bit of peace of mind so that's the review on the uh, gecko scepter 2.0 uh, if you like the review guys make sure you subscribe hit that notify bell and leave me a comment down below uh, i'd love to hear your thoughts on on what you think about this and if you have one um and if you have something similar and maybe there's there's better tools out there but uh, for me i really like the size of this you can kind of keep it in your bag uh keep it in your door um you never know when you're going to need this little glass puncher right here that's it's a handy little tool to have um, when you're out driving around so till next time guys, keep on crushing it and we'll catch you later.